Welcome to the OU College of Dentistry's introduction to the Vertical Teams Report in Axiom. The Vertical Teams Report is a custom report designed by the Department of Dental Informatics, which allows users to view team assignments and individual progress as students complete treatments. In order to give the end user the most relevant information, we have created two separate reports, summary and detailed. From an end user perspective, both the summary and detailed reports are run basically the same way. However, the information each compiles is slightly different. The main difference between the two reports is that the detailed report shows all remaining in process and planned treatments sorted by patient and assigned provider, whereas the summary report shows a count of completed treatments in addition to an overview of in process and planned treatment. With these differences in mind, let's see what this process looks like. To run both of these reports, open Info Manager in Axiom, click on the Custom tab on the top right, choose Clinical from the Category menu, and double click on the report you would like to run. A pop-up window will open asking for the vertical team or teams for whom you would like to run the report. You can add individual vertical teams for the discrete value drop-down, Burgundy Team 2A for example, and clicking Add, or if you want to see a range of two or more vertical teams such as Burgundy 2A through 2G, choose the first value from the start of range drop-down and the last value from the end of range drop-down and click Add. It's very important to remember to click the Add button or the selected teams will not be added to the search query. Also, you'll notice you can mix and match discrete values and ranges as I've done here, so a report doesn't have to be just range or discrete entries. When you have all the vertical teams added that you want the report to include, click OK, and a PDF with the requested information will open showing the students assigned to the chairs, as well as completed, planned, and in-process treatment counts marked respectively with a C, P, and an I to the right of the treatment count. To run the detailed report, it is the exact same process. Select vertical team analysis detailed from the custom clinical report list, Add the discrete values and ranges you want to report on and click OK. In the summary report, you are given a count of treatments. However, in the detailed report, you can see you are given the procedure ADA code, the site and surface, if applicable, the description and the status. Also, if a patient has not been seen for 90 days or more, their name will appear maroon. Otherwise, their name appears in teal print. As a side note, reports will often span multiple pages. So to navigate the report, you can use the arrows at the top of the page, or if you want to export it, click on the envelope icon, choose a location on your computer to save the file, rename it to something that identifies it, and click Save. And that's how to do vertical team reports. If you have any questions, feel free to stop by the Department of Dental Informatics in room 361 in the College of Dentistry, or you can call us at 55481. Thanks for watching.